Hey y'all, I'm Meredith Howard, and today I'm chatting about bonding over books. There are not many better ways to connect with your kids than through sharing a book together. So today I'm gonna to be highlighting storybooks that are perfect for that goal. If you're interested in learning about some of our amazing chapter books from Osborne Books and More, um, please talk to me, or if you have your own independent consultant, please check with, with um, him or her to find out a lot more about those amazing chapter books that can be great for your older readers for reading aloud or for reading independently. Right now I'm sticking with the storybooks. Like that's not my series, this is That's Not my llama super sweet great books to introduce for those youngest readers my four month old loves these books there are touchy feely textures on each page as you go through each one that is not there so for example we have that's not my llama its nose is too fuzzy and then you get to the end and you see oh that's my llama its ears are so soft kids love to interact with the books through those touchy feely textures tons of um, books in this series and even preschoolers love those books speaking of preschoolers we love the i'm i'm a hungry dinosaur book this book is all about dinosaur who's super hungry and wants to bake a cake there are lots of colorful words throughout, lots of sweet illustrations, as well as great rhyming, rhythmic reading. So it's very fun for kids to read over and over again. We have loved this one, and it's a great one for connecting together over your fans of food. The Night Night on the Farm book is so fun and so interactive. Each page has a mini board book that you can pull out to help the animals on the farm go to sleep. So like I said, there's each page has one. So there's actually four mini books throughout the book um, to be able to read to those animals. We also have a new one that's called Night night on the town that could be a big hit for your readers as well. The Muddle and Match series is very fun. One of our go-tos, this is Muddle and Match Superheroes. These books introduce alliteration in a very creative way. So for example, Tilly Terrific, the turbocharged Titan travels tirelessly through time. And then kids can maneuver these flaps to create a unique character or a unique story every time that they read it. So it's very goofy, it's very fun. Um, kids love to explore the books in that way. This is Owl, is one of our favorites. This is a, a response book where you can actually respond to the story. Your kids are a part of the story. You meet Owl, who um, you're getting to know. You're getting to know his day. But each page has an opportunity for you to interact with it. So for example, this says clap three times to switch off the sun. And then turn the page and you see what happens next. Kids love to be a part of the story and they are incorporated in and engaged in it all the more. The Complete Book of Farmyard Tales is one of our family's go-tos. This, this book actually has 20 stories within the one book that follows the Boot family on Apple Tree Farm, has an audio CD for listening on the go or even at home if you're having some quiet or rest time. This book is called A Dual Reader, so it has a shorter line of text across the top and a longer one across the bottom. You can read just the top for a shorter story or both for a longer version of the story. And then when your independent readers are, when your readers are ind reading independently, they can read the top while you read the bottom, so they are actually joining in the story storytelling experience and all the more engaged because of that because of that the Billy's Adventure books are some of our family's favorites. This is her our outer space adventure. This follows Billy B. Brown during her preschool years, and you get to see where her imagination takes her every day. So in this case, she's going to outer space. My girls love to see her creativity and how she explores using simply her imagination. We love these, have all of them, and they read them all the time. Cleopatra Bones and the Golden Chimpanzee is a part of our Fast and Furry Racers books. These books are really fun and funny. It's all about hunting hunting down some golden treasure um, that all of the animals are on the hunt for. It actually has codes throughout the book that you can break or decode. Um, so it's another element to be able to engage in. It's fun. It's got great rhyming. So once again, one of those books that you'll want to read over and over. A new one called Where Happiness Lives is all about discovering whether or not if you had more or if you had a bigger home, would it actually make you happier? It follows little three little mice as they go back and forth to one another's homes to see what it's like. And then they come to find out that Happiness actually exists um, no matter where you live. It's about the memories you make and the people that you share those memories with that actually bring you happiness. Nibbles the Book Monster is one of our favorites, all about Nibbles, who eats his way through familiar stories like Goldilocks and the Three Bears or the Little Red Riding Hood. It's very fun and funny as you see Nibbles' antics throughout these books. They, they recognize the stories and they see how he kind of changes them up or mixes them up to make something new and even more creative um, as you are exploring through the book. Really fun. Like I said, independent readers even love to share read-alouds with you. The illustrated storybooks are great books for that goal. So this is an example, illustrated fairy tales. We have illustrated stories from Shakespeare or from Dickens or a new one, illustrated stories from China. And these have multiple stories in each book that are perfect for reading aloud, especially with a little bit older readers. This is in one is all about fairy tales. Like I said, we have lots of different options in the illustrated storybook series. These are some of our go-tos, and I know you will definitely be bonding with your readers while reading these books.